Hey, I'm James from J Technology, and we are here at CES 2015 in Las Vegas, Nevada. We are here at the Sulon Technologies booth, and we're going to go talk about the new uh, virtual reality Cortex device we have here. Uh, and we have Dan uh, Balachet, and he's going to go over what Sulon is all about. Dan? Well, Sulon is actually all about enhancing the human experience, and what we've actually came up uh, produced was the, um, what's called the Cortex. The Cortex is an augmented virtual reality system. What that means is that it actually spatially maps your physical surroundings around you and changes that environment into augmented and virtual reality experiences and fusing them together. For example, placing like ravenous zombies at life-size scale within your own physical environment that chase you down, but they're contextually aware of their surroundings and so they know where to uh, where to come get you, like through doorways and where, where, where there's openings in the, in the environment. They're that contextually aware of their physical surroundings. Um, to actually completely uh, immersive worlds where you can actually live out uh, like surreal experiences and not just, be, not just be confined to the physical environment, the system can actually redirect your walking to actually walk miles and miles of straight path, but you don't know they're actually walking around in circles. Um, so what it, unlike other uh, VR and AR headsets, the system has a spatial mapping technology that can uh, that's aware of its surroundings and manipulate the, the surroundings to allow you to live much greater experiences than be confined to uh, a sit down or uh, just a stand stand up experience. So it's not basically just like the other um, companies out there. It's not just for gaming. It seems like it's more more than that. No, it's a, it's a giant system, and what it does is it allows you to actually uh, virtualize uh, a BMW or, or 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 a car in on your driveway and actually see it before you before you buy it and actually walk around it, open the doors, get inside it, upgrade the car, change the leather seats, change the color before you transact it. Show it to your friends. It's true scale to the point where you need to relax, but you don't have the time to take a flight for 10 hours to go to this resort, but now you can live it in your living room, right? And uh, we got demos here from engineering all the way up to gaming experiences to cinematics, right? You can now live out movie experiences. Um, if you're going, if you build, if you built like a, uh, an engine part within your CAD workstation, now you got a virtual, like, the problem with, 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 this, uh, with this current approach in engineering is that uh, it's, it's very complicated to actually take that 2D drawings and actually manufacture it without having any bugs. Now we can have a greater in-depth knowledge of that, uh, of that drawing or that engineering model you just created, and you can actually virtualize it in scale in your real space and interact with it and see all the different parts through scale before you manufacture it. So the, like the, it's limitless boundaries. It's just pretty much um, it's up to you, whatever you imagine. The special thing about the Cortex is it's, it's a standalone untethered AVR system. So you put it on, you go. Now it does have the capability to piggyback off other high-end computing systems to enhance its computing uh, and display technologies, but in itself, by itself, it's a, it's a standalone system. And I also notice on this model here, you have a sp sphere on the back? Um, yeah, so this is called uh, a spatial scanner. This actually does all the, the spatial scanning of the environment, and it's, uh, it's the part that actually is contextually aware of the, the physical uh, environment. We call it the spatial scanner. And last, uh, price and availability. Um, okay, so the price right now is four nine nine for developer kits, and we are accepting pre-orders. Uh, we're expected to launch uh, Q one Q two of twenty fifteen for the developer kits to ship out, uh, but we can't comment on the consumer uh, release date right now. And website, if people want to check out the website to find out more information. Uh, definitely, the, it's, it, the web the web page is a little bit in stealth mode right now. It will be revamped at, throughout this week, uh, where you can find a lot of, a lot of information regarding the Cortex. Well, thank you, Dan. Thank you.